Welcome back to my online video tutorial series. At the end of this video, you should be able to draw a circle to pass, to pass through two points. A graphical representation of this is this circle of radius R passing through point A, passing or touching point A and point B. All right. The objective here is to find the center for this circle. As you can see, the center from A to B is the same as from B from C. From A to the center is the same as from B to the center. It means, therefore, to find this center, all we need to do is to open our compass to the radius of the circle that we wish to blend the board, pass through both points using A as center, square of an arc. Using the same radius at B, square of an X arc. At the point where both arcs meet is our center. Let's draw this. In this case, we wish to use a radius of 30 millimeters. The next step is open your compass to 30 millimeters. With A as center, scribe our first arc. Using the same radius, with B as center, scribe a second arc. At the point where both arcs meet, label that point O. With O as center, open your compass to OA or OB. Next step is to draw a complete circle. Okay, there we go. That's so all there is to it. So let me recap a bit. It's important to note that to draw a circle to pass through two points. Open your compass to that given radius. Whatever the radius is, open your compass to that measurement. Using the first point as center, draw an arc. Using the second point as center, draw an X arc. Okay? And it's important to note that it doesn't necessarily have to be a complete circle. It could have been an arc. So it could be a scenario where we have two points here, one point here, another point here, and we want the arc of a specific radius to pass through or to join these points using an arc of a specific radius. Say I want it, you want it, want it to be uh, 50, simply open my compass to 50 using the first point as center, square by an arc. Go to the other side, same radius, square by arc. At the point where both arcs meet here, use that point as center. That's how we get an arc of a given radius to touch two points. Thank you for watching.